There's a new ghost kitchen in town and it's delivering a New Orleans style flavor to your door. Where is Sherman? He's live with a local chef who's betting her dough on a ghost concept. Good morning, Sherman. <laughs> hey, good morning, Lindy and Daniel. This place is so cool. Actually, just open. Just opened on Monday. It's Chef Burrell's Kitchen. We are on Michigan Road between 71st and, and 69th Street, North Michigan Road. If you're familiar with Eskenazi Health Center, it sits right in front of there. So that's the locale. But guess what? You really don't need to worry about that because the ghost kitchen is all about bringing it to you from the kitchen to you to warm your heart and your soul. Good morning. Good morning. This is uh, Chef Teresa Burrell. It's great to see you again. Good to see you too. And look at all this. Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you got a, a great chef background. I do. Trained chef. Yes. Uh, a Scoffier Culinary School. There we go. So you got it going on. I do, yes. And it is all about uh, Cajun and, and Creole. Creole. Yes. There's a difference, but you bring them together? You do bring them together. Um, Creole food is a tomato base with a rich roux sauce. So that would be the gumbo and the shrimp creole. And our Cajun dishes, that is more like the jambalaya, okay. the crawfish, boiled crawfish boils. And that's your specialty in that's both? My, yes. All right, what do and you got on the stove? I'm right preparing now? dirty rice, so I just dumped in the rice. This has chicken livers, chicken gizzards, and chicken sausage in it. That's some dirty rice. Dirty rice. <laughs> yeah, and what's over here? This is my Cajun chicken pasta. This is my top seller. This has Moscato wine in it and heavy cream. So this is the, the base for that. This so is the base, and then I'm going to pour in the Moscato wine. And then you, and then you pour it over pasta? Over the pasta. the pasta in, or how does that work? I pour it over the pasta because some people do not want pasta. They may want rice. Oh, okay. So, oh, so I, you can do either yes, or. Yes, either or. All right, now explain how this ghost kitchen concept works. The ghost kitchen is just a food preparation facility, so it's not open to the public. We're going through DoorDash, Grubhub, Uber Eats, and Menufy. So you place your order at home or in your office and through the app, and the food delivery drivers will come and bring it to you. So no contact? No contact at all. So, yeah, I mean, we told you where they are, right? But the, you don't need to come. That's what mm -hmm. I was saying earlier, because it's all done through an app and, uh, or online. And by the way, we have a link to her website at fox59.com. It's uh, Chef Burrell's Kitchen. That's through Menufy. Menufy, yes. And then if you download or if you have the app for Grubhub or DoorDash, you, you would order it and you find the menu through there. Yes. And speaking, here we got some of the stuff that's on the menu. Yes, we have our shrimp po' boy and our jambalaya. Okay. We have our oyster po' boy with our seafood gumbo. Now these are all combos? Combos. Okay. And you can order it with the combo or without. And this? This is our catfish po' boy with uh, crawfish etouffee. And then this is our soft shell crab. It looks like he's getting ready to say something. Yeah, to he's jumping out at you. Hello. <laughs> and this? This is our um, andouille sausage po' boy. And then our uh, smoked sausage po' boy. Smoked sausage. Yes. Okay. So here's the deal. You go online. Again, Chef Burrell's um, website, mm -hmm. Chef Burrell's Kitchen, or order through uh, the apps. So this, I, I love your presentation with this, too. Thank you. Isn't that beautiful? Uh, we've got more coming up. She's got dessert. she got 7-Up cake. Pound cake. Pound cake. And then, of course, the po' boys. Yes. Sandwiches. Sandwiches. Yes. Sandwiches. <laughs> <laughs> Sandwiches. we got those <laughs> coming up as well. Chef Burrell's Kitchen. It is a really cool concept, the ghost kitchen concept. Look at that. Mm. Can I go in? He's been eating well for the past years. years.